do you want to get somebody out of your life that you know is not supposed to be there? You know what I'm saying? But for whatever reason, you just keep hanging on. Uh, do you want to break a bad habit? You know what I mean? Uh, do you want to always be on your P's and Q's? Do you want to learn how to discipline yourself to be a better man or woman? Here's a psychological trick that I utilize. I think about somebody who I want to impress, like my mother, my father, you know what I'm saying? Think about your grandmother, your grandfather, your uncle, your aunt. Uh, like when I was in a joint, I had a little dude that I was schooled in person that I called my little brother, Kimball Butte. And there were certain things that I would that not do. I wouldn't fight certain people or do certain situations because I knew he was watching me. Now, how can I explain to him you know what I mean? In this case, you can use little, your son or your daughter, your you know niece, nephew, whoever the situation may be, little brother, little sister. But how can I mentor him and do the complete opposite of the things that I tell him not to do in my mentorship? You see what I'm saying? So again, when you're dealing with somebody in your life and you, 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 you want to step up to your P's and Q's all the time, you want to go to that next level, somebody that's supposed to be in your life, and you know that they're a, a more of a detriment than an asset, you know, think about this person that you want to impress being in your life. Think about them always being around you. You know what I mean? Remember when they came around, you was, you had to step up all the time. You know what I'm saying? So think about your mother, your father, whoever it is that you want to make happy, who you want to be proud of you and doing the right thing. Always think that they are around or say before you respond or react, what would so-and-so say? What would so-and-so do? What would they think of me if I did this? How would they see me if I did this? What would they say to me if they saw me doing this? You see what I'm saying? What would they do if I remain with this person and I know? You see what I'm saying? So always think about, you know, that person that you want to impress is always around you. You know what I'm saying? God. For real, for real. You know what I'm saying? God is watching me. How would he feel if I did this? How would he feel if I did that? Think about those things. And for real, when you put that impact on there, it can change the direction of what you were going to go or what you should do. That's really something that I do in many cases.